Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing another review of a pair of Christian Louboutins. Alright guys, so I have a bag here. This bag, it says Christian Louboutin Paris. Inside the bag, we have another brown box that has Christian Louboutin Paris on it. And these are a pair of Louboutin Suede Louis Flats in a size 44.5. Inside the box, two dust bags. We have another pouch that has shoelaces in it with red writing that says Christian Louboutin. Just like my last unboxing, we also have a little pouch, red ribbon that they tie up the box with. I normally take these out of my shoes and I add my own shoe trees. That's like one big thing that I want to tell you guys. When you guys are spending this much money for a pair of shoes, you guys should spend the extra $15 and just buy a pair of shoe trees. Sometimes like when I know that I'm changing shoes, I will bring a pair of shoe trees in my bag with me to stuff back in the shoes just to make sure that the moisture doesn't ruin the inside of my shoes. There's nothing worse than a pair of shoes that are like like lost their shape that are leaning on the side i think that's like the worst thing in the world like i always look at people's shoes i don't know why i'm so obsessed with sneakers and the worst thing is like dirty sneakers that look like you've had them for like three four years and they're just like falling apart Ugh. before i show you you guys are gonna think they're outrageous and crazy without further ado here are my suede Louboutin bleed flat spikes in color sun are these shoes are sick like these shoes are so amazing when the light hits the spikes they like just glisten and shine like look at this these like they just like glisten it kind of looks like diamonds here these shoes right here retail for $1,295 after tax, I believe I paid $1,380.36. The backstory on these shoes is that the first pair of Louboutins I ever purchased were these right here. They're so crazy and outrageous. Like they had blue, green, orange, and black, and they were all spiked, and they had a woven pattern. And when I brought them home, I was like, what can I pair these with? I tried them on with everything. I could not pair them with anything. So I decided to return them and I went back and I bought two pairs of Louboutins and these were one of the pairs that I bought. I'm so happy that I did. I kind of wanted something a little more subtle, not a lot of crazy colors, but I wanted something that was definitely crazy and that stood out. And these shoes definitely do that. Pair this right here with either a really light wash denim um, with a white t-shirt, a black leather jacket. That's pretty much what I would pair this with or even like a pair of gray skinny jeans with a white t-shirt, deep V with a black leather jacket. You really don't need much when you're wearing these because these shoes make such a statement on their own that you don't want to go too overboard and pair them with other crazy items because you're just gonna look like a big crazy ass mess. This right here is just a suede circle with the enamel plaque that says Louboutin on it. As you can see when I was showing, they are a little dirty here. You actually can't see them with the eye, but on camera you can definitely see right here where there's a little bit of dirt. I wore these shoes once out to a really fancy nice dinner. Suede is such a delicate fabric they will get ruined if you don't take care of them. Like, I personally would never wear these shoes like out in like a club scene, a uh, bar environment, because like they're gonna get ruined. Hey guys, so I hope you all enjoyed this quick review of my suede Louis flat spikes. I hope you guys found this video informative. If you guys would, just go ahead and give this a like. If you guys wanna see more, please comment below, and don't forget to subscribe.